Hey everybody, it's Diana again in broad daylight. This is New Year's Eve and I'm on my way to my friend Judy in Columbus. We're having lunch. Yeah. And um, I haven't got my lips on because we'll be wearing masks except when we're eating. So. Who needs slips when you're eating? <laughs> so, um, it's kind of a overcast like it's going to rain today, but it hadn't really rained yet. So, we'll see what happens with that. <laughs> so, I hope everybody is planning a eventful New Year's Eve. And you've got your New Year's, New Year's resolutions ready. The only thing I'm really planning to do is to quit vaping. That's the last thing I plan to do. Everything else is fine. I'm just hoping that um, 2021 is going to be better than 2020. I was expecting 2020 to be the best year yet, but didn't turn out that way, did it? Except meeting some great people like Naya. And, you know, I'm lucky, I'm blessed to have met some great people. And I believe a lot of that had to do with uh, the pandemic and stuff because, you know, we had to hang out and chat and stuff and stuff going out and doing all these things. So some of you ladies I have met through that and I'm blessed to have met you. Uh, but especially Naya, she is my heart. She is so sweet and she's so supportive of this old lady. So um, I give a really big shout out to you today. <laughs> so I'm gonna get off here because I'm fixing to get on the highway. And I've got to stop up over here at this bakery and pick up Judy some donuts. Her and her husband love donuts. And I think she's going to start on a diet first of the year. Miss Jean said she was starting on a diet too. But I've gotten rid of most of my weight. So I'm not having to worry about that. Just maintaining. Not getting crazy over the holidays. And I haven't. I'm so lucky that I haven't. But a part of that has to do with is fixing my plate and going away from everybody else and not watching them eat all that stuff. But it wasn't because of the, the diet. It was because of the pandemic and I didn't want to be too close to folks. But yesterday, I went and had a, a um, COVID test done by the National Guard over at the uh, health department. And within 15 minutes, they came back with, with uh, my results and they said that it was almost always accurate and that I didn't have anything, I'm clear. But they said if anything came up that they would send it to my email address. So I didn't want to go to Judy's house and because being around people during Christmas that maybe I'd be carrying something to her and her husband because they're both over 75 so I didn't want to do that so I'm going there with a clear conscience today bye girls and guys